Good morning, guys. It is uh, a beautiful morning, May 1st, Monday, uh, and it is time to build our compost pile, uh, the spring pile. So let's go. All right, to say I'm uh, a little giddy, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited about this one. Uh, prepped it from last year. Uh, we grabbed uh, an extra pile of uh, leaves and uh, stored it over the winter. As you can see, it's now full of uh, life and warmth, so we're gonna use that as a carbon source. We're also gonna use the uh, wood chips that helped overwinter the warm bin as a carbon source as well. Now, for the nitrogen, we're just using all the stuff that we ripped out of the garden, um, broccoli, kale, brassicas. Uh, we have some grass clippings. There's sod, there's English ivy, there's, I can see some corn, uh, and just other random stuff. So we're not gonna worry about the CN ratio. I, I really never have. And uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna build this and uh, see what happens. Okay, so to, to start off, we're gonna start with carbon. We're gonna start with some, uh, some leaves, and then we'll just kinda go uh, browns, greens, browns, greens, and then finish on browns. So when I flip it, browns are on the bottom, and then, uh, yeah, everything will uh, kinda get mixed up. Now the difference with this pile is I'm not gonna flip it nearly as much. Cross my heart, hope to die. Um, yeah, maybe two to three turns. I just wanna see Kind of do a more doubting approach to compost and just see how that goes. Um, I, I will run some of the um, the thicker carbon stuff through the lawnmower just to get the particle size down and, and get all that biology going. So, um, so yeah. And the other weapon I'm going to use is uh, the lab. Um, I'm going to use the rest of this up. It, I've had it for just under a year now. And I added brown sugar to it just to make it um, uh, last longer. And uh, we'll add that in there um, to get that biology going as well. So let's go. Rip, radish. Last year's pepper plants, soil and all. So as you can see, yeah, it's just browns, greens, browns, greens. Um, again, not worried about the ratio. So uh, what we'll do is a little, just pause and record, see how much we get in there, and uh, yeah, go from there. All right, we're 20 minutes in, working up a sweat. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna have to put the front board on. I'll change the camera angle a little bit. And uh, yeah, we still got some stuff to go in there. So this might be a bigger pile than I thought. Let's go. A little bit of lab for good luck. Um, yeah, it's bigger than I thought, but uh, that's great. So that took about an hour, hour and 20 minutes. So, but I did get the lawn done. Well, most of it. Uh, I couldn't uh, bring myself to cut the flowers. But uh, anyway, so that's gonna be our version of No Mo May this year. We'll just leave a few little patches. So yeah, carbon, nitrogen, carbon, nitrogen, green, browns, whatever, whatever they say. Um, super special pile. 
I'm uh, not gonna touch this. It's part of the uh, the challenge. We did a video, um, I think it was our last video, and we had, I mean, awesome comments from all you guys, but there was one thread that had like 20 or 30 comments in it, and people are trying to drum up an international composting challenge. I have no idea how that's gonna happen, but with our uh, life circumstances, uh, we're not gonna be able to spend as much time as we'd like in this garden um, this summer, so, uh, and that's okay. Um, it, it actually creates an opportunity. So what we're gonna do is we use uh, a COF. Um, it's a 442 um, in, in a lot of our uh, plantings when we plant things out. But this year what we're gonna do is uh, we're not gonna do that. We are gonna plant straight into our compost. Maybe what we'll do is we'll do a few with the COF and then just be able to compare and uh, see how like the fertility is, see how drought tolerant things are. Um, it'll be really, I think it'll be really interesting. So that will be our form of a challenge. Um, if you guys wanna get something going, awesome. I don't really know how to do the tags um, and uh, the other the other yub tub stuff. So, um, but yeah, that's gonna be our challenge for ourselves this year is to see how well our uh, stuff does in our straight soils uh, with no, uh, nothing added to them. So um, yeah. Super special pile. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to stay out of it. I will try my best. Um, and uh, yeah, I think I, I will be able to. So um, thank you guys so much. Um, coming up on two years of my first uh, compost pile. And I just love this stuff. It is so, so great. So um, please keep the comments coming. Uh, any suggestions, concerns, whatever. Uh, drop them down there. And uh, we'd love to hear from you. So yeah, life... Uh, Life changes fast, so uh, you guys uh, stay awesome.